Right, good afternoon. My name is Bo Swanson with Brand Bellows RV in Shakopee, Minnesota, right across the street from Valley Fair. Really excited to tell you about our new uh, Winnebago Ellipse Model 42QD. Uh, it's just brand new on our showroom floor. It's going to be a top of the, one of the top of the lines for the Winnebago products. Um, as you notice, as we're going to walk around here, we're going to have a built-in Onan's generator right in the front cap. All LED lighting. This coach is equipped with uh, full body paint. Sickens paint is what they use. Um, you're going to have turn signal camera, backup camera, all those uh, gizmos and gadgets um, right built into the mirrors. Now as I look down over here, we're all gonna, that's where all your fuse panel is going to be for your push in 12 volt fuses. And this full body paint is going to wrap right around inside of the slide out system too. This is going to have the trim package, the chrome trim package at the bottom of the whole entire coach. Um, right over here, I get asked a lot going, where's the LP? Well, the only thing that's going to run off the LP on this coach is going to be an external grill, so that's your LP tank. Uh, so you're not going to need all that big tank no more. Uh, right over here is your main storage compartment. This is on a lower rail chassis, maximum chassis. Slide out tray, you'll be able to slide this tray out left or right. Uh, your batteries, your house batteries are going to be in the center of the coach um, for helping with that uh, stability going down the road. Back in the day they would have the batteries sitting off to one side of the coach so the coach would tilt. Now they're in the center of the coach um, to give you more stability. Again, more storage underneath. Right above us, we're going to have awnings, protect, uh, protective awnings right over the windows. Each window will have its own particular awning. Um, next bay over, you're going to notice it's going to have the aqua hot system. So this is going to have a heated basement, um, and then it's also going to have solar panels. Um, then, of course, off to your right there, you'll see your 50 amp cord, um, which is a power reel cord, which is a great feature to have because these cords do get heavy. All right. A lot of people ask me, Bo, what's this for? This little door is for the um, for the refrigerator, so you have access to get your, your lines uh, for your uh, ice maker, to drain your ice maker. Right over here is our water compartment. You're going to have a hose on a reel already. It's going to come equipped with the sewer hose. Um, it's going to show you where all your volts and stuff are right here. You're also going to have um, your water pump switch. You can start your generator, have auto start on your generator, Santa flush, um, built-in water filter, and both your gate valves. Um, all right here in one compartment. It's also nice, you got your little light you can turn on, so if you're pulling in that campground at night, you'll be able to see everything that you're working with. As we move on back throughout the coach, you're gonna notice that this is a tag axle coach, because it's a 42 footer. Uh, so you're gonna have two extra wheels. Finally, in the last compartment back over here, your DEF, most of you all are gonna be familiar with that, that's your diesel exhaust fluid. Uh, so it's going to be, the, the, the exhaust coming out this coach is supposed to be cleaner than the air we breathe uh, from what I've heard. Again, more push button um, for your slide out controls. So instead of replacing breakers, you just push the button in. Another neat feature I liked about this, you're going to have power points, your negative and positive, and that's where you would jump the coach if you ever need to have it jumped if your batteries weren't dead. Now let's work our way towards the back of the coach. It's got a beautiful back cap, all LED lights. You're going to have your seven-way pin, um, 10,000 pound hitch on her. Uh, so you know you can tow your small car, motorcycle, enclosed trailer, whatever you have. 450 horsepower Cummins motor on an Allison six-speed transmission. This is going to be the Cadillac of coaches here. Now and over in this compartment you're going to find your extender for your ladder for the rear so you can get up on the roof, check your maintenance and your sealants and such. Then you're, you're going to have an awning rod in here also that's going to be just for the window awnings, not your main awnings, just the window awnings. Again, that beautiful paint job coming through the whole coach. Built in LED lighting in the awnings. This coach is going to be equipped with an outside refrigerator. You're gonna have a nice little refrigerator, nice little storage area, and then an induction cooktop. So you can 
cook your eggs on, on that Sunday morning right on outside. This coach is actually equipped with two Ottermans. They're still brand new in the storage compartment. This is going to be a shallow storage compartment. TV on a swivel with surround sound. Again, that's that storage tray that I pulled out on the other side. You can pull it towards you on this way, either way. A um, lot, lot of storage. And then you're also going to have the Dirt Devil vacuum system. It's going to have its own vacuum system inside the coach. All right. Again, this is on a maximum chassis. Well, let's step on inside and take a look. Off to your left, you're going to notice it's a great size shower. Um, as we work over to our right, you're going to notice that we got uh, the uh, medicine cabinet open so you can see how much storage there is. Um, good size sink and then a washer and dryer stackable uh, unit. It's the master bathroom back here. Now as we move forward, we're going into the master bedroom. The master bedroom, you're going to have the Freedom Air Bed so it'll tilt up and actually lay flat again so we can adjust the pressure left to right. Ceiling fan, all real woodworking in the ceiling and all the cabinetry. You're going to have um, a nice good sized TV for the back. Um, feature I like to boat this coach, if you can look right over here, you're going to have these panels and that's all push button for turning on your um, porch lights, your accent lights, your ceiling fan, all right there. You're going to find three different, uh, if I remember correctly, three different locations for those panels throughout the coach. Then a nice sliding door for a partition right off to our right here. Again, that same panel, this will be your service center. You've got your Magnum system, your uh, generator, your aqua hot, your thermostat. Um, that's stuff that, uh, you know, when it comes time to it and you want to come on out and ask us, we can go over all those little features for you. It's going to have the residential refrigerator. It's going to be a Whirlpool with a dishwasher with a bottom freezer. Or, excuse me, I should rephrase that ice maker with a bottom freezer. You're going to notice lots of cabinet space in here. You know, when they were thinking about storage, you got storage drawers, you got storage cubbies, you got everywhere in this coach. Again, all real woodworking. Off to our right, again, these are that panel I was talking about. You can control everything from one of these panels. Corey on countertops, double base sink, also that true induction um, stove top. This coach is actually equipped too with a dishwasher. So, And then what I liked about it is if you want more of a galley area, push that in and it gives you a lot more galley area. Same thing with the coach, it's an L coach that'll push in to give you a bigger galley area inside the coach. Um, as we step back a little further, we have a half a bath. So if you ever have that guest, you don't want them using your master bathroom, we got a, uh, basically I like to call them a guest bath, um, but it's a half a bath. We got the glide and dine dinette that's been around for quite a while. So in one inch increments, it'll move left to right, then it'll pull out and add a leaf and you can put two more chairs so you can seat four. Nice lounge chair. So if you're sitting at this lounge chair, you can pull this out, open it up. You got a nice little spot to work on your laptop or you know have yourself a little lunch. Um, and again, fireplace, electric fireplace that does produce heat. N I'm really excited about this. This is a really neat feature. Right up in the cupboard, you're gonna find a little lever. Pull the lever. This is going to pop open and that's where you're going to find your safe and your little wine dry bar area. Um, so you can put your valuables right inside that safe. Um, not too many people will know where you got stuff hidden. Right up in the front cockpit area, obviously it's ultra leather, flex steel seating. They are going to be, um, they both will 180 around. You'll have your GPS, you'll have your Pandora, navigation, um, automatic leveling system, uh, air brakes, 
you know, all the bells and whistles in this particular unit. Again, this is a 2017 Winnebago Ellipse, model 42QD. And I like to say thanks for uh, spending a little bit of time with me to look at this coach. Why don't you come on out to Brand Bella's RV right across the street from Valley Fair. Our number is 952-445-2611. Or you can um, just go right to our website, brandbellasrv.com. Um, and you'll find us. We have a lot more coaches to see here, all indoors. Um, and uh, I hope to see you. Thank you so much.